In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Welcome to Our Lady Loves You. My name is Father Zachary of the Mother of God, and we are presenting these episodes so that you can become the saint that you're created to be in God's love. All of our hearts, our minds, our souls, our spirits are uplifted when we pray that perfect prayer of Jesus, the God-man, who taught us to address God as our Father. We want to come to know God as our Father, to know the love of the Father manifested in Jesus Christ and His Church, the one holy Catholic and apostolic Church, where He gifts us Himself in the Word and the sacraments, in the Most Holy Eucharist, giving us the strength to live our baptism. We thank God for giving us the Holy Spirit that permits us to cry out, Abba, Father, to cry out that Jesus is Lord. We know that the Holy Spirit dwells in us and He moves us and He animates us. We've been given this gift to guide our lives. You have come to this lay formation program of our Blessed Mother, who is the daughter of God the Father, who is the mother and first and perfect disciple of Jesus Christ. Our Lady is the spouse in the sanctuary of the Holy Spirit, and we gift all of her relationships, her Trinitarian relationships, to you. Receive them now. Claim them. You will need them to arrive at your destiny. Our Blessed Mother holds you by the hand, and she will lead you as her child right into the life of the Trinity for which you were created. You have come to this lay formation program to learn how to live your baptism, how to be fruitful in your baptism, how to be nourished in the Eucharist, to come to the Trinitarian life, the communion of God's love for which you were created. You have come to a formation program. This program is not just about information. It's about formation. God himself, your father, my father, our father, is going to form us into Jesus Christ so that he can look upon us with love and smile upon us and bless us. For in Jesus, our Father gives us every spiritual blessing in the heavens. Our Father's desire is to see Jesus Christ come alive in our lives. Jesus Christ reveals the meaning of life to us. He came all the way from heaven to reveal that to us. Jesus Christ reveals man to himself. We're mysteries to ourselves. Jesus came to unfold that mystery to let us know that we are loved and to empower us so we can return this love, not just a merely human love. We are invited to a divine way of love. Would you like to receive this divine way of love? Would you like to be formed into this divine way of love? Our Heavenly Father, every moment of our lives is forming us into Jesus Christ. What a blessed life we're all invited to embrace. If only we can accept it. I know that this gift is so great that there's many out there who, who may hesitate at the call to greatness. But you are created for greatness in God's love. No matter what's happened in your life, know that God loves you. And that God has a plan for your life. And he will form you into his beloved son, Jesus Christ. You will participate in the life of God. We all need help, though. We all have to begin somewhere. And so today, if you hear his voice, harden not your hearts. Respond to this invitation 
You are all invited by God himself to know that he has a plan for your life, to respond to this plan, to come to respond to this plan as our Blessed Mother Mary responds to this plan. Our Blessed Mother, a human person, one of us, responds perfectly with every beat of her heart, with every breath she takes, every moment of her life she said yes to God's plan. And thus we honor and venerate her. We worship God. Only God is the one to be worshipped. But our Blessed Mother deserves to be honored and venerated above all human persons because of her generous response. But as a mother to us, she wants to train us, help us be formed. Training, formation, they're very similar. They go hand in hand. She wants to form us into another Christ as well. Because as a mother, she loves to bring forth life. Jesus came all the way from heaven to give us life, abundant life, eternal life. Today, we ask the Holy Spirit to open our hearts to receive this life. No matter what's happened in your life, today is a new day. We are a redeemed people. Jesus Christ is our Savior. He redeemed us. And just as the sun rises every day to remind us of the new life, the fresh start that He won for us, now make the decision to let Our Lady, Our Blessed Mother, lead you to Her Son, Jesus Christ. Let Our Father draw you to His beloved Son, Jesus Christ. Let the Holy Spirit guide you. Let Him form you. Let Him breathe upon you. Let Him embrace you. God loves you. As we go through this formation program, we'll continue to develop what formation entails. How in the events and circumstances in your lives, God will be working to train you, to help you grow in wisdom, age, and grace, to come to the full measure of the mature Christ. We'll teach you how God is working in your life. We'll teach you how to have enough of a relationship with God so that you can see His loving hand in everything that's happening in your life. We'll teach you how our Blessed Mother cares for you with a tender affection and a loving concern as only a mother can to form you into Jesus. Everything in your life has purpose and meaning if only your eyes are opened. Remember, we walk by faith, not by sight. We want to put on the mind of Christ and have our heart respond generously as Christ responds to the will of God. The program of formation is lifelong. But in the Society of Our Lady of the Most Holy Trinity, we have a three-year program as a foundation for your life so that you can learn how God worked in the life of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Our Lady of the Most Holy Trinity, a human person like one of us, to learn how Our Lady said yes to God's plan at all moments of her life. We will follow Our Lady's life and parallel it to your life. Too many people separate themselves from Our Blessed Mother because of Her holiness. But Her holiness should draw you. The fact that Jesus gave Her to us at the foot of the cross, His last gift before He commended His Spirit into the hands of the Father, this gift of Our Lady is a great gift. We learn from her life how God cares for our lives. 
And we will follow her life for three years to learn how to follow her life all the days of our life. Seeing how God's hand is involved in the life of our blessed mother and our life is what formation is all about. Then, in the circumstances of life, your daily life, that's where you'll live out this formation. This formation is personal. It's also communal. We're here just as instruments. The Lord be with you and also with you. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Go in peace to love and serve the Lord.